Hey guys, got an update for you. Yep, the bumper's off, the headlight's out. Well, um, ended up going to get the AC recharged. Yeah, I know I should do it my, you know, I should have done it myself, but I didn't get charged. They told me the AC compressor was toast. That I didn't believe because the AC pump cycled before without a problem. Well, what we found was the lower line had cracked obviously from the accident so it didn't look like it was broken but it was so when they tried to they pulled vacuum and tried to charge it it cracked it blew out so they told me to fix it bring it back and they do it again well i said screw it yep i got that harbor freight set up cost me 89 for the pump and this was $59.99. So right now we're uh, checking it on the vacuum. I'm gonna let it sit for about another 15 minutes and see if it actually holds pressure and then we can start charging it back up. Hey guys, got it. Used a can and a half of R134A, as you can see. Holding right where it should be. Here we go. And it's cycling fine. It's about 75, 80 outside. The furthest we've got it to drop down is about 38 degrees. That's still pretty good. Total spent just under $200. That includes the pump, the manifold gauges, the R134A, and some time. Now, I'm going to show you guys something. If you guys get the Harbor Freight Kit, make sure you get the valve. They don't tell you that. This is the one we use. But here you go. Total time doing it, all together, about an hour.